Only on two, we uncover another tow truck company acting without a license. CBS2 first told you about Take Me Home Towing two months ago when dozens of cars were towed from their illegal lot. Since then, their license was revoked, but cars are still missing. CBS2 Sabrina Franza has the story. People are going to lose their vehicles. They're going to lose their insurance. It's way bigger than just, ha ha, I'm taking your car. Ripley Hammond's car was in an accident Friday. Rush hour on DuSable Lakeshore Drive. Take me home towing shows up. These people pull up yes. acting like they're going to help you. As I was shaking and looking at the damage and the airbags that had went off in the middle of downtown as I'm standing there shaking and they come up being human saying we can take your vehicle. Um, it's evil. Now Hammond can't find her car. Every time she asks for its location, she says Take Me Home tells her a different address. They also charged her thousands. Even if I find my car, I'm one of the fortunate ones enough that my insurance is willing to pay the $6,000 bill for the two-day tow. We first told you about Take Me Home towing in May when the city was towing the cars they towed to an illegal lot. Then we started digging. Take Me Home Towing was originally Tow Pros Inc., but when that was shut down by the Illinois Commerce Commission, the owners started Take Me Home Towing. After our story aired, they received 17 administrative citations from the state, and on June 27th, the ICC revoked their license again, days before Hammond's accident. It's extremely hurtful and damaging. My name is Sabrina Franza. Again, we tried calling Take Me Home Towing. I was wondering... Mm. These people know what they're talking about. Hammond filed her own police report. We will keep following up until she gets her car back. Sabrina Franza, CBS 2 News.